hello everyone welcome to excel 10 tutorial in this tutorial i'm going to talk about different currency sign in microsoft excel let's get started there are almost 180 currency in this world and you can add most of them in excel how you can add it you can either add the currency symbol like we have here dollar sign or you can write the short form which is usd for united states dollars you can add currency symbol in this way and i'm going to talk about how you can insert this currency symbol how you can remove this and what the best way to use currency symbol in excel so let's write five here and adding currency symbol is actually formatting the cell so we are formatting the cell in a way so that it will display the currency symbol before or after depending on that currency a number okay so we have five and usually our dollar sign is at the left of our number so it should be placed right here okay dollar sign then five so under the home tab in the number grouping we have this arrow here click here and it will open up the format cell pop-up here we can add dollar sign in two ways either we can select currency or you can select accounting okay so we're going to use currency option here and the default option is the dollar sign if you want you can change this default and in a future tutorial i will talk about that so our dollar symbol is here already placed and if i click ok and you can see it's five dollar and the dollar symbol is placed now what if i want to add usd before the amount I don't want the symbol here how can I do that click here currency symbol and click on this drop down remember I told you about almost 180 currency in this world and we can add most of them so this is the list these are the currency symbol and short form we have in Microsoft Excel you can add anything you want from this list now we need to find out the USD written here and here we have the USD written so click here and click ok and you can see usd5 now if i click on this cell in the formula bar you see only the amount here okay so these are just simply formatting that you can add here let's add the pound symbol here click here currency click on this drop down and scroll down and here we have english united kingdom and this is the pound sterling symbol select this one and click ok and if I write here any amount in this cell, you can see our pound symbol is added. So if you want to change it to GBP, you can do that. Here we have GBP. Click OK. Now, in this way, you can add different currency symbol anywhere you want. Now, I have formatted only this cell as USD, this cell as GBP, and this cell PHP, which is Philippine Peso. But you can change the formatting for a column okay so in column g if i want to format it as usd so from the currency this is the default and now if i write anything here it will be added as dollar sign okay now here in this column if i format it with euro let's format it click ok now if i write anything here you can see the whole column is formatted as euro okay now you can add this type of formatting to different column or different row if you want and the way is simple just like we have been doing here so if you want to add philippine currency which is philippine peso you can get this symbol and this short form same way you can add canadian dollar malaysian ringgit pakistani rupee indian rupee australian dollar bangladeshi taka which is bdt and united arab Emirates dirham aed south african rand and you can just go on and on so we have a lot of currency symbol collection in microsoft excel you can use it just like i showed you here and if you want to remove this currency symbol it's just select all the cells that has that currency symbol formatted and here click on general all the currency symbol has been changed or you can select from this drop down number or general so currency symbol will be removed okay so this is how you can insert different currency sign in microsoft excel and this is how you can remove them 
and there are a lot of opportunities you can check them out and in the next tutorial i will show you how you can change this default currency symbol like this one if i select here if i click here this accounting number format automatically dollar sign is added if i select here click here and if i click on currency you can see the dollar sign is by default if i click here accounting the dollar sign is by default if you want to change that you can do that also and in the next tutorial i'm going to show you how you can do that this is what i wanted to show you thank you thanks for watching see you in the next tutorial please share this video with your friends and don't forget to subscribe if you can please support the channel through patreon and see you in the next tutorial